Welcome, welcome ladies and gentlemen. This is the Libran um, Business Zoom Career Reading. Um, this was done in the month of September, but it is programmed for a five week. These are um, timeless reading. Um, so be aware of that. So, all right. So we have the energy of happily ever after for you liberals. And I see a lot of you liberals that was looking for some sort of a financial stability. I see an extra job, an extra work. Um, this is going to be definitely coming in. So this is wonderful. A lot of you have been looking for some sort of an extra work, extra stability. Um, and you have um, caught up in the month of August and um, you got that opportunity. So a lot of you are quite happy um, moving forward and this is going to be good. Extremely, extremely positive. Um, this is really positive alignment of energy. So this is good. So um, Librans, wow. Um, Wonderful, wonderful. So, what is happening and is transpiring? Um, this is powerful um, because if you notice the heartbreaks, the heartbreaks is um, over. So, it's as if some of you liberals were hoping for a new job, hoping for um, a new stability in your world. Um, however, this was coming up, some sort of a hope um, is going to be fulfilled when it comes on to your financial um, um, situation. So let's go in and see. So um, this um, month and this period, I should say this um, um, period that we um, are going in is um, going to be wonderful as you get to the end, okay? Because the end of this five week period. So let's show this. So what we're seeing is that you're dealing with a whole lot of emotional situation on the work floor. Um, it, 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 it can be in on the work floor, in your business with other people, okay? But what we're seeing here is um, some sort of a news um, that some of you were hoping to receive from your boss. Um, that is uh, um, a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person. It's not going to be good. Okay. So if you notice here, Librans, um, you're dealing with uh, a corporation. And I see um, whatever it is, you're waiting on some sort of a information, some sort of a news. Um, you are dealing with friends. Um, colleagues, um, co-workers, and, um, you know, they have gotten some sort of a good news. Um, this could be a study um, that um, they have gotten some good news, but you liberals are waiting. Um, but the news is not going to be good for whatever the reason is. Um, the news is not going to be good because here you can see that your colleagues are here, um, you know, showing their achievement and what they have done and you're waiting for your last paper but it's not going to be good because if you notice the corporation institution is in reverse um your professor is here um you know it's not going to be good so um heartbreaks is in it because um you begin the month with a whole lot of heartbreaks okay and i see what is going to be transpiring is that uh, um your happily ever after is maybe you realize, okay, so this was not meant for me. I'm letting this go. Okay. And that's how you are going to be healing whatever this issue and this situation is because you're going to be realizing, oh, this is my seventh time, fourth time of, of, of doing the study. And still I haven't gotten through this. Okay. Let me let it go. So I think that you're going to be coming to some sort of an understanding that um, this study or this situation or this uh, um, uh, project or this business associate or um, whatever it is that you thought 
okay because they are doing it they advise me to do the same it's not working out for you liberals and i think that you're going to be realizing yeah this is not what um i was meant to do because it's not really working out for me so whatever the issue and the situation is and whatever it is whether or not um this was something that you were looking forward to do whether or not this was something um that you wanted to connect to however this is happening and this is transpiring your happy everly after is going to be realizing that um what people expect of me that is not who i am so i'm going to be making sure that i am happy with my career decision okay so it could be that friends are saying look um you know if i start for myself and i start for myself and look how much i have made and why don't you do it for yourself and you do it and you're waiting 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 for the results and the results is not good and this is the the month that you're going to be realizing hey um not everyone doesn't have the same luck you're just going to be realizing that everyone doesn't have the same luck and um some people are lucky um in doing what they're doing some people have luck in certain things and some people don't and i see this is where you're going to be realizing that um yeah um yeah this is this is how it is and uh, you're going to be realizing that some people have luck in certain things and some people do not and you're going to be accepting that because you're going to be finding out and realizing that life is full of surprises and um you know you have been working towards a better um stability a better way of life but um it works for some people my friends have pushed me in that direction um i've went in direct that direction it didn't work i i went in the other direction where my parents sent me it didn't work and now you're going to be accepting your own direction and that is going to be making you very happy ever after so we come in um a lot of you were hoping um open that uh, um um these people your boss and your supervisor would have helped you out with a situation but unexpectedly you realize that they threw you under the bus so it's as if some of you have this so it says okay um you know i i'm having some sort of an issue maybe in your private life it is affecting your work and you you thought that your supervisor I was going to be supporting you but your supervisor and your boss is working against you and is going to be throwing you onto the bus so, so especially you young um people um young people um don't expect your boss and your supervisor to have any um you know having any sort of a yeah um this person is really having some personal issue they're going to be thinking okay they can't do their work um not my problem let's find somebody new so you're going to be um realizing that uh, uh you know the people who you had their backs in the past they don't have your back right now and especially at the work floor they're going to be um people are just going to be letting you fall and some of you are definitely going through some sort of a personal some sort of other personal issues and the people who used to be um you know going to lunch with you coming by you finding out you know what uh, how you feel about certain things they're no longer there and they're no longer there because um these people have realized um that it is time for them to choose and 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 protect themselves and this is where you're going to be realizing that everyone chooses for themselves no matter what is happening people just choose for themselves and you can see this because what we're looking at is that whatever the issue and the situation is no one is having any sort of a oh my god oh you know we really have to just like give this person some time to regenerate and you know fool their energy to come back no people are like yeah the work needs to get done and that's it and a whole lot of you are going to be just realizing that yeah 
I just lose my mother, I just lose uh, this, I just lose that. And it, it's hard for me to like focus when I'm at work. And they're going to be thinking, yeah, if you can't focus, well, yeah, you know, we can replace you. So it is going to be an, um, a mind blowing for a whole lot of you that is going to be realizing that your colleagues, um, some of you could be really having some sort of a personal issues or some of you could have been really going through some sort of a issues, uh, whether health issues or whatever. But it's as if uh, your bosses and your supervisor is like, yeah, work got to go on and um, things got to go on. Yeah, you can have your mind on something else. But when you get in here, you need to be focusing on your work. And I think they're, they're going to be just, um, you know, hitting you in the, in, 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 you know, having no sort of a empathy for you and just telling you how it is. They're going to be saying, you know, like pull up your bootstrings. Otherwise, we are going to be looking for someone else in order to fill your place. So. It is sad, um, there's no question about it, um, but it is a sort of wake-up call for some of you. Whatever is happening in transpiring, it is uh, some sort of a wake-up call that is going to be happening for some of you. And you need to be aware of this because it is, um, you're going to be hit like a brick, um, some sort of a wake up call that is going to be aligning you about whatever is transpiring in your world because you got to be awakened in this month of September. Okay. So whatever is happening with you, Librans, it's, it's, it's like you're going to be hit realizing that people who you used to help out on the work floor, um, you know, your colleagues, people who you're connected with is as if everyone is standing on their homes and everyone is just doing their things, going home. Um, people are no longer um, connecting. Um, you're just going to be feeling as if there's a void. So whether you're going to work or you're working from out of home, you're going to be finding out this sort of a situation that is transpiring. And I think that this is actually much better for you liberals because it's about time for you to balance um, your inner spirit when it comes on in order to make the right decision because sometimes, um, as a Libra, you will, um, you know, really do things that you think, okay, and now it's as if some of you, sometimes you're sharp and some of you could have said something that just clear the room. So be aware of that, um, in this, um, the same um, um, period. So what we see is some sort of a regrets, regrets um, dealing with a cancer or a liberal person. Um, it could have been your boss or your supervisor. Some sort of a regrets because you had, you would have expect this person to really support you in a situation. And they are going to let you fall. This is someone regrets that you had an affair on the work floor. Um, yeah. Uh, some of you um, could have had some sort of a uh, affair with someone, whether a supervisor or a boss or someone at your work. And now you're regretting this because um, you realize that this person just basically... Uh, use you and now you're regretting this because some someone else is coming up and is saying hey um you know that this and this person and I went out and showing you pictures and that sort of a thing and you're thinking yeah but that's the same thing the person has done with me so I see how um, a whole lot of you especially young people are going to be regretting that you had an affair with a boss or a supervisor because you're going to be finding out from another co-worker that they have done the same thing with you okay and I see that is where you're going to be finding out wow all right I wasn't aware I didn't see this coming I was not aware of what was happening and transpiring and I see that this is going to be shaking up a lot of you and it's as if you're going to be clearing the way of people around you some of you are dealing with the water sign 
people at the workplace, it is not um, looking good for your liberance, whatever is happening in your spine. Um, I see some of you who um, didn't have any um, diplomas and that sort of a thing, they're going to be finding out. And I see that some of you are going to be laid off um, because they're going to be taking on people who have... Um, um yeah that's yeah so i see that some sadness is going to be coming in um for some of you then i see the energy of the king of cups um in that third week so you're dealing with supervisors that is uh, water sign people pisces cancer scorpion okay you're dealing with managers or supervisors who are also um, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion. Whoever these people are, I see that you young people are going to be having some sort of issues because they're going to be creating some sort of issues for you. Why? Maybe because you have finished your karma in this company or with this group of people. So I see that some of you are going to decide I'm not going to fight this, you know, whatever is happening, whatever is transpiring. I'm not fighting this. Let it go. Let it be. Um, if this is the time, if this is um, when this contract ends, uh, um, okay, I'm not fighting this. You know, let it be. And, and, and this is how I see that some of you are going to be resolving whatever is coming up in this period. Okay. It's as if you're going to be saying, okay, so I understand. This is how... It works. This is the end of whatever karma I have to deal with these people. This is how, um, you know, people create this sort of atmosphere and then they close off. This is what the new world looks like. And I see you're going to be accepting that and just leave this period um, healing yourself and understanding exactly what was happening and transpire yourself to something much better because you're going to be going within and as you go within you're going to be finding out and realizing and learning a lesson that uh, it's all about uh, um that people are just um you know turning their backs moving forward trying to um you know create their own uh, stability while you have been connecting with other people you realize that these people have moved on and left you behind and this is when you're going to be realizing in this month that uh, it's all about you creating your own wealth you creating your own stability you are understanding where is it what it is that you want and going after this okay after you have seen that people are all for themselves and by that you're going to be realizing who you are as a person choosing to be who you are and do not let someone else change you and becoming that beautiful soul that you are by using your own empathy in order to work with people through whatever issues that is happening okay so uh, I see some of you are just going to be deciding um, to make some changes in your world and around you and you're going to be leaving it at that ladies and gentlemen the extended is going to be coming up if you want to see the extended of this reading um, use the link below in order to get to the website um, and always order three readings um, the three first months or the um, just order three readings because that will give you an idea of what is coming up for the three last month. Um, these are timeless readings. So whenever this reading come up in your feed, it's when you're trying to figure out something. It is not a month of making any decision. Okay, no decision. Um, it is a month of you finding out and seeing. It's not a month of making um decision or it's not a time period of making any uh, um decision. Okay, so I love you guys. Gotta go. I'll see you on the other side. If not, have a wonderful month.